Hey, everybody, this is Dave. Um, you know what? I have to address this issue. Why? Because Mormonism is clearly trying to convey that they are Christians. There's been a lot of propaganda going out. CTRLDSLiving.com. I get so much information coming to from them to let me see what their thoughts are. I have to reveal this because as a as a Christian speaking to other Christians or LDS who are Mormon who are who are watching the show right now, this was a article that was actually sent out by CTR. And that's Choose the Right. It's a Facebook group and, and it's a writer that, that talks about uh, many Mormon, Mormon things and things that could help Mormons. So one of those sort of blog spots today, if you will, uh, was a article presented and it, and it says this, and I'm showing it to you right here. As a matter of fact, it says seven ways to grow closer to Heavenly Mother and include her in your worship. Okay? Um, I don't think any Christians speak of Heavenly Mother in the way that Mormons are trying to showcase her as Heavenly Mother. Now, as Catholics and, and maybe Orthodox, Lutherans, high, high churches, we, we certainly talk about Mary being the mother of God, no doubt about it. But to come out and, and say that it's important to worship Heavenly Mother. Now, I have to give you an idea for those who don't understand Mormonism. Mormonism believes that there is an exalted Heavenly Father and he is married to an exalted, if you will, a, a person comparable to us in, in flesh and bones, married to a wife in heaven. And this Heavenly Mother is really more of the mother of, of all, if you, if you will. It's a very strange concept. Um, I've said this before many times that Mormonism really looks at their Heavenly Father and now Heavenly Mother as, you know, the perfect marriage in heaven. They have the perfect marriage. And it's very humanistic in the way they, they kind of view God and Heavenly Father and Heavenly Mother, that they, they look like us, they're exalted beings with bodies and they they are up in in heaven and kolob if you will and they they basically produce produce all this offspring which would be us now you've got to realize that's not what christianity believes um certainly we do not believe that but they believe it and they claim that they know it's true um Obviously, when we look at the Bible um, and we try to understand the church, there is really no essence of Heavenly Mother in the sense that they view Heavenly Mother as the wife of Heavenly Father and producing all these children. I mean, this is way off in, in thought and idea compared to Christianity, but this is what they are discussing. These are the seven ways to grow closer to Heavenly Mother and include her in your worship. One, to incorporate her in your prayers. Okay, they are now wanting Mormons to, when you pray, Pray also to, to Heavenly Mother, the, the wife of Heavenly Father, to incorporate her in artwork or a daily reminder to think of her a lot, to incorporate her more in your worship. When you worship God, you also worship Heavenly Mother. Now, does this sound kind of strange to you? This should sound strange because it's so far away from the Christian understanding of God. Wouldn't you agree now? Now Mormons are called to worship Heavenly 
mother. They have been making this transition this past two to three years and talking about heavenly parents a lot in their, their conferences. This is what we're seeing more and more. I have to wonder, I have to wonder, is this a reason why they're bringing Heavenly Mother a lot more, trying to be equal with Heavenly Father and exposing her more because of more of the feminists that are involved in the LDS church, the Mormon church, and they, maybe the brethren, I guess the administration or whatever, feels like maybe it's important now to start showing Heavenly Mother that they're equal in, in some ways. And maybe ultimately they feel that if they can show this, the women would feel more satisfied because the men have the priesthood, but now they're showcasing Heavenly Mother. I have to, I have to question these things. Um, they also said to reflect on her regularly in the temple, to think about her, also to learn more about her. This is another one of the, of the things they want people who are Mormon to, to learn about her, search for her in scriptures, and show your gratitude in how you live your life. And just express that and say, hey, Heavenly Mother, I'm just, just thankful and grateful for what you've done and the type of person that you are. Now, you got to remember, this is Mormonism. This is really what is going on in this faith and what they're trying to convince you as Christians to believe in this type of um, Heavenly Mother God. It's it's weird stuff, but you got to know this is what they believe and they're 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 professing it now and it's coming out more and more. I'm just actually uh, in, in ways blown away that so many Mormons are accepting this to worship Heavenly Mother. I mean, it's, I don't know. It's, it's, isn't it saying the scriptures were only supposed to worship God and now they, they're bringing Heavenly Mother in. It, to me, it's, it's just so earthly, so, so humanistic in a, in a way. It's just, I don't know. I don't know. Please write down below. Tell me what you think about this. I'm sure this is blowing your mind if you're um, a Christian listening to this, or uh, even if maybe you're Mormon and you didn't know this was going on. This is what's happening more and more. All these new changes, these new ideas. You got to be careful, guys. Uh, you got to be really careful of what's ha heading down the path of Mormonism. Um, it's, it's getting really scary. And so just think about those things that I've shared with you. Write down anything you want to write down, please. And, and if you like what I do, please subscribe. Um, we have over 10,000, almost 200 subscribers right now in the ministry. And it, it's uh, very happy. I'm very, very happy with that. A lot of people are liking. I get people all over the world talking to me and uh, calling me. So I uh, hope this has been an eye-opening sort of understanding about now how Mormons are trying to worship Heavenly Mother. Anyway, God bless you guys. Um, thank you for watching and have a good day.